Today, I'm diving into something that's going to reshape the cities we live in for the better. Let's talk about SUMPs, or Sustainable Urban Mobility Plants. You might be wondering, what's a SUMP exactly? Well, imagine a roadmap designed to make urban transport more efficient, eco-friendly and accessible for everyone. SUMPs are all about reducing traffic congestion, cutting down on pollution and making it easier for people to get around without always relying on cars. First up, let's break down what a typical SUMP includes. One of the key components is public transport. Cities are investing in better bus and train services, more frequent schedules and modernized stations. The idea is to make public transport so good that you'd rather hop on a bus than sit in traffic for hours. Then there's cycling infrastructure. Ever noticed how some European cities are bike-friendly paradises? That's because they've put serious effort into bike lanes, bike sharing systems, and safe parking options. It's healthier, cheaper, and sometimes even faster than driving. Walking is also a big focus in sumps. Pedestrian zones, wider sidewalks, and safer street crossings are all part of the plan. The goal here is to make walking not just possible, but enjoyable and safe. Of course, we can't forget about electric vehicles. Charging stations are popping up everywhere, and cities are offering incentives to switch to electric cars. It's a step towards cleaner air and a quieter environment. But SUMPs aren't just about infrastructure. They also include policies like congestion charges, carpooling incentives, and even apps that help you plan the most efficient route using multiple modes of transport. So why should you care? Well, SUMPs are designed with the future in mind. Imagine cycling on dedicated bike lanes or catching a bus that arrives exactly when you need it. These plans aim to make your daily commute smoother, cheaper, and a lot more sustainable. Plus, SUMPs create job opportunities in urban planning, environmental science, and tech development. If you're passionate about making a difference, this is a field with huge potential. So, next time you see a city council meeting about urban planning, don't just scroll past. This is your future, and these plans are paving the way for a greener, more efficient world. Various strategies and technologies shape the future of urban mobility. From electric vehicles to smart public transportation systems, cities around the world are adopting innovative solutions to create more sustainable and efficient transportation networks. Let's start with electric vehicles. They're not just cars anymore. We're talking about electric buses, bikes, and even scooters. These electric options are not only reducing our carbon footprint, but also cutting down on noise pollution and making our cities quieter and more pleasant. Next up, smart public transportation. Imagine a bus that knows exactly when you'll arrive, or a train that adjusts its schedule based on real-time passenger data. Cities are using AI and big data to optimize routes, reduce wait times, and improve the overall efficiency of public transport. Then, there are the multimodal transport apps. These apps are revolutionizing the way we plan our journeys. By integrating various modes of transport, like buses, trains, bikes, and even ride-sharing services into a single platform, these apps help you find the quickest, cheapest, and most eco-friendly way to get from point A to point B. Another exciting development is the use of autonomous vehicles. Self-driving cars and buses are being tested in cities around the world. These vehicles promise to reduce human error, cut down on accidents, and make our roads safer for everyone. Lastly, let's talk about renewable energy. Solar-powered bus stops, wind-powered charging stations, and buildings with green roofs are just a few examples of how cities are integrating renewable energy into their urban mobility plans. 
These initiatives not only support sustainable transport, but also contribute to the overall health and well-being of urban environments. So why is all this innovation important? Because it's not just about getting from one place to another. It's about creating a future where our cities are cleaner, our commutes are smoother, and our lives are better. By embracing these technologies and strategies, we're not just moving forward. We're moving toward a more sustainable and efficient world. As we bring this introductory series on transportation planning to a close, we hope you've gained valuable insights into the complexities and opportunities within urban mobility. Transportation planning is more than just moving people from point A to point B. It's about creating sustainable, efficient and inclusive systems that enhance our cities and improve our lives. This journey is just beginning. The tools, strategies and principles we've explored are the foundation for building the cities of tomorrow. Thank you for watching and I hope this course will enable you to be part of the movement towards smarter, greener and more connected cities.